Integrated fire safety systems specialise in the design, supply, install and commission of fire detection, fire suppression and smoke management systems. Hello, this is how the panel looks in a normal state. And if you want to uh, close the dampers, this switch right here, turn it to close. And give it a minute for it to uh, activate. <coughs> Click mute here to uh, mute the buzzer. As you can see, some of the lights are disappearing, but don't be alarmed. This is just the process. As you can see, these red mirrors indicate being closed, and if you look up here, it says open, vault, and close. Closed red mirrors. They should always be in the auto mode stage on this key switch. If you want to open the dampers, switch it to the whole other side, and it will go through the same process. Now we're going to activate a switch on the ground floor to show you how it looks like. This is what happens when the fire panel is in fire. As you can see, all the dampers have opened. Now they're starting to close. Indicates what floor is on, ground floor, fire. After everything has been checked within the and there is no fire, you can simply silence the alarm by clicking silence. Once you've pressed reset on both panels, it should return to its normal state. As you can see, all the dampers are open and there is no Neo indicator on any other fire on the sprinklers. So, thanks very much for watching the video. We hope you've enjoyed it and learned a little bit. If you want to watch some of our other training videos, we have a load on YouTube, so you can click through those. Or you can visit our website, www.ifssystems.co.uk or call us on 0844 357 5839.